Okay. Yeah, I'm ready. We're rolling. Look, before I say I, I say hi to the people at home, let me start with the commanders. Commanders, morning. 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 Commanders, morning. 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 Um, so the people at home, to you two, we say hi and everyone else in the studio. Uh, look, this quote is a joke. It's a waste of state, state time and resources and money. There's a lot of people in in poor communities who can do with this type of attention and money. Let's go give the goggles in Soweto to the camera attention that are being raped every day. The goggles that are living in fear because there's no big boys, people, ah. drug addicts that are raping them on a daily basis. Yeah. Our people are living in terror in townships yeah. and across communities. Even in, yeah. in, the, in the fancy suburbs in Santons, the people are living in serious fear. Yeah. We're in a lawless country. Absolutely. It's just unfortunate. So when people, when politicians think that it's a better investment to attack a progressive young person of the country, instead of helping and assisting and making sure that these young people are more resourceful so that the country can go forward. They see it fit to go and stand with drug dealers that we are fighting and yes. say that yeah. we as politicians yeah. are, are standing with the drug dealer yes. so, so that the drug dealer can open a, a mythical case yeah. against this, these young people. So you must understand the country that we are all living in. It's an unfortunate country. Yes. But all I know is that when the people speak and the people come out, at the end of the day, the people shall govern. Because the people that are currently the governing they've forgotten who they are where they come from yeah. and we'll make we'll send a soft reminder of who they are and yes. if they don't wake up yes. to that realization they're going to realize once the people have taken over this country That's because true. we as the That's ordinary true. people are going to take over this country we are tired of the nonsense we're tired of the politi the politicians selling our country to the highest yeah. mm. we're tired of the politicians selling our community That's to true. the highest yeah. yes. so if you if, if you paid attention i spoke less about my court case and more about the people of the country yes. Yes. so this court case really has nothing to do with me yes. it's just to suppress the voices that are emerging because the nonsense voices that are that are filling our parliaments that are doing nothing in parliament yes. just want to hog the positions of power Lead. and that will never work yeah. it's a matter of time the, the, the 2024 is right here Alleluia. i might not emerge but i know the people will emerge yes. whether through me or through someone else but the people will emerge Lead. and once the people emerge then politicians and all their political systems will understand that the time is over. Yeah. The time is up. We do not care for what happened yesterday. Yeah. They're trying to feel the hate amongst young people. Mm. I must hate the Indian fella. I must hate the colored fella. I must hate the white fella. Let me tell you, I'm not hating anyone. All the young people of South Africa are going to come together and take this country forward. Yes. We are not going to yes. be yes. any means. Wow. So we are here to send a strong message and we're saying that the yeah. punches they're throwing to us, we are not even blocking them. We yeah. are smiling at them yes. because they are way too old and frail for their punches to hurt us those parliament people there. Speak, so man. we're not scared Speak. of them. So yeah. they can they can continue and South Africa don't be surprised tomorrow when you hear that Tanta Lux was was in Europe and he, and and raped uh, tw twelve year olds. Yeah. They yeah. will cook up stories every day. Mm. Yeah. So we are not going to be deviated and diverted by their stories. Yeah. We know their agenda. Mm. Their agenda remains our communities. Yes. Their mm. agenda remains putting South Af South Africans first in South Africa yes. and yeah. everything else comes second. Yes. So to all South Africans, we are saying the hope is alive. You will be put first in your own country, yeah. and everyone else and everything else will come second. Yes. So that we say, Commanders, morning. Okay, so, um, what is expected on the 27th of July? Is it just for yeah. further investigations? Or yeah, look, what's expected on the 27th of July when we return here at Rodiport Magistrate Court is nonsense. Mm -hmm. So people can expect comedy. Maybe maybe some comedians might come in and yeah. give us more more energy of the day, yeah. but there's nothing serious here. Yeah. You can't tell me that there's a young person who went into a drug dealer's house Amen. with the police, with all law enforcement, ah. and then the, the drug dealer with the, the politicians are saying that I stole 300 rands oh. and a DVD Ooh, and a flat screen. That's that means the police... Yeah. Are also are also part of the crime. Yes, they they, they are an accessory to the crime. Yes. If that if indeed there is a crime, that means on the twenty seventh of July I must stand here with Peggy Kaila because as a as a head of the police, he also committed a crime. How, how do you how how do you get arrested alone when at a particular point of of of, of the crime you were with the police? Mm. Why, why wasn't that reported to the police? The man was in his own house with me and the police being present. Why did they say, police, this man is taking my DVD. He's taking my TV. Mm. He took my, my 300. Yeah. He took my phone. Yes. No, no, you wait after until you consult your, your, your so-called CIC, who's only known to make noise at stadiums and rallies, yeah. but not be impactful in the real issues of our people on the ground. Yeah. I didn't yes. want to attack that yeah. man, but it's very disappointing from young people to see politicians who are in parliament siding with drug dealers and ah. doing this to our community. Yeah. It's disgusting.
So to them we say that we'll treat them with love always, we'll not attack them because they too, all, all these politicians, unfortunately or fortunately, they will also be beneficiaries of our leadership. Yeah. Come the day, come the time, they will also be beneficiaries of our leadership. We will yeah. not say that yeah. because they did bad to us yesterday, mm. well then today because we are in power, we'll yeah. do bad to them. They'll be the first point of correction so that the young people can see what happens to old people who lose their minds and politicians who forget why we voted for them. Yes. Morning. Yeah. Morning. 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 Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you.